Hi, my name is Gilles Fedak and I'm CEO and co-founder of iExec. Today, I'm really happy to speak to you about the new version of iExec, the version 3. This version has many features for enterprises and consortiums and plus it introduces a new paradigm for monetization of your data. So, there will be many announcements in this video, so stay tuned until the end. iExec is a decentralized marketplace for computing resources. It allows anyone to monetize their applications, their dataset, and to trade computing power. So think it as an open market. Providers and requesters interact directly as with peer-to-peer -peer network without any central authority. iExec develops the technology and the protocols that organize the exchanges between the stakeholders with the maximum level of trust, security, and efficiency. And to do so, we leverage blockchain and distributed computing. Today, it's time for version 3, which has a new major feature, monetizing datasets. We are therefore very excited to announce the brand new launch of the iExec Data Wallet. The Data Wallet allows an individual or enterprise to monetize their valuable datasets on the marketplace. How does it work? Well, data providers list their dataset and set a price for which they are willing to sell their usage. Through iExec, the dataset can be used with an application combined with remote computing power. Dataset provider, application developer and workers are all paid automatically by smart contract each time their resources are used. So, as you understand, this opens a new business model for data providers that we call data renting. Indeed, data providers keep the full ownership of their data and payment happens each time the data is processed by an application. So, why does it matter? Artificial intelligence is a great use case for data renting. For instance, deep learning algorithms often rely on particular data sets such as neural networks. Actually, training a neural network for computer vision or image recognition is known to be a difficult task. It requires a lot of computing power, skillful people and access to large amount of data. Therefore, a trained AI model is expensive to produce. Thanks to this new approach of data renting, an AI model can now generate revenue thanks to the iExec Data Wallet. Today, we also open the iExec Data Store. Here you can already find a collection of free open source datasets that can be used to build your own AI model. For example, you will find a history of cryptocurrency valuations and you may run an application that computes predictions of the price of cryptocurrencies. We also have improved the governance for resource sharing by developing fine-grained access control. For example, data providers can select which application can process their data, which worker pools are authorized to download their data. These whitelisting or blacklisting features offer complete control to data owners. When renting their data, data providers remain their sole owners. This has huge implications in terms of privacy and protection. Requesters don't have access and cannot copy the data set they are using. Similarly, requesters are the only ones able to download the results of their computation, ensuring total confidentiality of their endeavor. More, thanks to the usage of Intel SGX and Clays, we also protect the data from being copied by the workers. As such, enterprises using iExec can benefit from advanced access control and governance options. They can select which partners or clients have access to which resources and monitor all transactions on the blockchain. iExec V3 allows for the secure sharing of data, application and computing power. By combining distributed computing, blockchain consensus and trusted execution environments, the iExec decentralized marketplace addresses the needs of enterprises and consortiums to improve and create businesses in leveraging blockchain paradigms. This is why we are launching iExec Enterprise Edition to provide the needed tools and services to leverage iExec stack. From now, iExec provides auditing services, development services, and deployment services for companies wanting to go fast. Being chair at the Enterprise Ethereum Alliance, we have developed a stack totally compliant with the latest industrial standards. The exact keywords are resilient, flexible, and secure. We are an ecosystem. We want to empower others. We want them to be able to compete on a worldwide scale thanks to our advanced technical layer 
providing huge adding value compared to centralized businesses. In the context of our move to address the needs of enterprises, we are very thrilled to announce that GPUSPH, a software used by EDF, has been deployed on the Isaac network using the SDK V3. EDF is the fifth biggest utility company in the world with 33 billion market capitalization. The GPU SPH application is a very useful visual simulator of particle hydrodynamics that can be used, for example, to study water dam. One of the goals of Isaac is to optimize the cloud computing resources of enterprises. Following so, the first work we have realized together with EDF is the deployment of GPU SPH on Ethereum and enabling it to run on EDF Worker. So we are all very proud to present iExec, a new implementation of our full stack, uh, proposing a more stable middleware, more stable solution, and also proposing some new features. First of all, we have rewritten entirely our middleware to propose something more robust and more uh, resilient. Then also, we propose a new version of our smart contracts to propose a fully decentralized brokering system. And this new solution cost, um, is, is less costly in terms of uh, gas consumption. And finally, we are also very happy to propose a solution for corporate and consortium um, with uh, some technique of uh, bridging and POA technology. So you're a developer and you got into blockchain and you discovered the wonderful world of dApps. What a cool world. Yes, but you also quickly realized that blockchains hardly communicate with the outer world. In fact, they are siloed. So how can you build dApps that are truly useful? How can you build dApps that have access to the real world without compromising on their integrity? Well, we have the solution for you. You may want to rely on a decentralized oracle or what we'd like to call a doracle. So who may benefit from this? Well, all sorts of dApps that rely heavily on Web 2.0 data. So decentralized stablecoins like DAI, decentralized insurances like Etherisk, tokenized assets, etc. All of these can make use of decentralized oracles instead of centralized ones and make themselves even more resilient. This feature has been requested from us many times in the past, so we made it happen. So documentation is live, go check it and see you on Slack to take it even further. Our marketing goal is now to bring the word out for V3 worldwide. That's why we've organized a release tour that will stop in many countries, France, USA, South Korea, Italy. It's going to be great opportunities to present the project to enterprises and to make our dev community grow significantly. Furthermore, we're very happy to announce that we have sealed a strategic partnership with B9 Lab to provide the best training you can imagine on the iExec stack. To sum up, the iExec marketplace is censorship resistant, autonomous, transparent, unstoppable, secure, and resilient. And today we are also announcing that after three successful test rounds that we called Worker Drop, the Worker Pool is now up and live. So you can connect your machine right now to this Worker Pool and start earning RLC tokens. On top of that, our GitHub repos are public and user-friendly documentation is available. It will help you with everything, how to develop your dApp, how to use trusted execution environment, how to become a worker, how to monetize your data sets. All answers are in there. So go check the marketplace, play with it, exploit different uses and start doing business with it. And just before V3's demo, I have one last major announcement to make. Version 4 was originally scheduled to be released next year on May 2020. This is the high performance computing version that will integrate GPU support on iExec. Well, we are moving ahead of schedule and we are excited to announce that version 4 will be released this year in December. So now enough with the talking and let's see a demo. Happy building folks! <laughs> I'm going to show you how we can use a dataset with iExec v3. This is the front end of an application called NSFW. It stands for Not Safe for Work. Say you want your users to load a picture and you want to make sure that it's compliant to your own policy. That's why you want to apply a filter and get this done automatically. So in this demo, we're going to use a dataset 
that is encrypted. So this is a machine learning trained model. And we are going to use this picture as an input. And the output is basically going to be yes or no. Of course, I have to make sure that my account is ready. I mean that I do have a receipt to spend. I'm going to need that. Here we can see that as a user, I'm paying for using the data set and for the computation itself. So I'll just trigger the execution, signing one first transaction and signing a second transaction. So active here means that my analysis is uh, currently being processed. There. My analysis is now completed, so I just can click to download the result. Once I've done that, I can simply check what's the result. And on this file, I can see that everything is okay. So now I know that my picture is safe for work.